and welcome back to another episode of Road Back to India. In this series, I've mostly been watching Bollywood movies to learn more about Indian culture and maybe pick up a little bit more uh, of Hindi. You guys give me all the best recommendations and this week I picked Swades. Swades? Swades. I don't know how you pronounce it. To watch because you told me I can learn more about Indian culture from that movie. If this is the first video of me that you're watching, hi, my name is Ivana. Nice to meet you. I've been to India before and I made almost 60 travel vlogs. So if you want, you can check those out first and then come back. And I'm going back to India probably at the end of September, beginning of October. If you click that subscribe button, you can travel along. Without further ado, let's get into this video. There we go, Swades. We the people. By the way, I did not tell you this before. I actually dreamt of speaking Hindi. Well, not actually Hindi. I said Shukriya to someone in my dream. And I know it's Urdu, but still, like, I was doing it in my dream. That's crazy, right? Oh, he's going to look up his <laughs> old <laughs> nanny. <laughs> cool. Oh, where is she? He just said Shukriya in the movie. That's why I remembered. I was like, I dreamt speaking that word to someone randomly. Kiowa, what happened? Is that correct? I think so. Kia is no. Kio is why. Kia is what. So Kia, Kiowa, what happened? Ah, oh, this is fun. He's going to a village. I read about the village life in, in the book Shantaram, but I've never been in an Indian village myself. This was funny, by the way. He wanted a caravan because he didn't know what the conditions would be in the village. And yes, from Shantaram, I know like it could be a little bit simple, but it also sounded like a lot of fun and adventure. I don't know. Oh, I love this song already, man. This is so cool. Yes, coordinated dancing, a little bit. I think I'm really going to like this movie because the images of the countryside already look so pretty. And the song is awesome. Yay, you found the lady. This is so cute. She's so happy to see him. Oh, why is she doing this? Is this some kind of a blessing or something? Or is it like a cleansing ritual or something? To cleanse him from all his American ways. I predict Gita is a very hot young lady. <laughs> he will fall in love with it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Hello, hot Gita. Me chanahum. I'm going. Or is it me chanahum? Hmm. I'm going. Chana or chana? Not sure. Oh, I remember the power failures in Kochi. It was very adventurous. This is so interesting. Is it like a village council or something? Does this still exist in the small villages? It's so interesting, man. Ooh, the girl is very modern. She wants to continue working after marriage. Be it in any field, women are making their mark equally. Can you hear that? Being in any field, women are making their mark equally. Go girl! Awesome! I love this movie! He's even falling even more in love. This is so interesting. They are talking about the problems of India. Oh snap, he just insulted them. He said, you Indians can take criticism. And Kavaryama was like, you Indians? And he was like, oh, oh, sorry, we Indians. They are talking about caste. This is so interesting. This is such a good movie. Thank you for recommending me this. She's calling him an NRI, non-returning Indian. He's not going to be an NRI for long. My prediction. Oh, and I predict that he will also be a teacher in her school. Is he going to kiss her? Is he going to kiss her? Kiss her. Kiss her. No. Damn it. He's taking a massive road trip and I know exactly what the purpose is to show him how beautiful India is and how much he misses it. Ah, oh, the simple village life. I love seeing this man. I, I've never seen this in India. Oh wow, this is so sad. The man was a weaver and then there was no business in the weaving industry anymore and he wanted to be a farmer but nobody wanted to help him because they feel like he should stay a weaver. 
And it's like, I think it's about the caste system, right? I know the caste system is still there. Although people have been trying to modernize it and to take it out of society But you still have to fill in your cast in some forms, right? So um, It's getting better, but it's still there a child just uh, sold him water a child that should be in school and he, I think he just realized he needs to stay and Help his country to a higher level. Oh wow, he's gonna wear a traditional dhoti? Dot, dhoti, I don't know how to pronounce it. And she's helping him. Ah, you told me about this festival. Uh, Dushera, something like that. When uh, the bad god Ravan is defeated by Lord Ram, right? Right? And they burn Ravan, right? Right, right? See, I remember things. Uh-oh, he disagrees with them that India is the greatest country in the whole world. Oh, this is beautiful. Wow, I really like this movie. I really like the thoughts behind it and everything. Like, like you have to evolve and innovate in order to reach your highest potential. I think, right? It is Ravan being burned to celebrate the victory of God Ram. I looked up the date of Dushera for this year, 2016, and I hope to be in India by that time. Yo, wait, what? She drops this like a bomb, like it's nothing out of the blue? What? I respect it, but I am just as flabbergasted as he is. It came out of nowhere. Is it going to work? Is it going to work? Are you going to have electricity? But you know it's Shah Rukh Khan, it should work. And it will work. I'm quite sure it will work. Yay! Of course it works! He went back home and he's missing India and I totally understand. I don't know what India does to you, but it's like... It's so mind-blowing and it changes you. And of course it's not my motherland, but... It is beautiful. I love it so much. Yes! Of course he had to come back, man! Well, this movie obviously really sucks. And I totally disagree with everything they said and I will never watch anything you recommend anymore. Just kidding! Of course I love this movie, I loved it so much. It was one of the best movies I have seen. Thank you so much for your recommendation. If you have any other recommendations, put them down in the comments below. And to make it a little bit easier for me, these are the movies that have been recommended a lot. Rang de Baijan, I think. And uh, also Tanu Wets Manu. Which of these two should I watch next week? You can comment down below or just put some thumbs up with the comments. Thank you so much for all your recommendations. If you like this video, put a thumbs up. If you're not yet subscribed to my channel, click that subscribe button because then you can travel along when I travel back to India. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week. Bye!